Software Spring Presence How to use Rank.avg in Google Sheets Hello folks! Greetings! Welcome to this tutorial on the Rank.avg function. Here's an introduction to Rank.avg. Rank.avg assigns a rank to specified value by comparing it to other values in specified dataset. Rank.avg assigns same rank, which is average of sequential ranks of duplicate values to each set of duplicate values, if any, in dataset. The data in dataset need not be sorted. Rank.avg can assign a rank to a value by considering values in dataset in an ascending or a descending order. The default is descending order. Alright, here's the format of the rank.avg function formula. Let's look at an example. Value is the number for which the function assigns a rank. The value can be, for example, a cell address or hard-coded number. Data is the dataset. It can be an array or a range. The value will be compared with the numbers in the dataset. Is ascending is optional. It has a default value of 0. It means that rank.avg will consider the numbers in the dataset in a descending order. Use 1 for as ascending attribute, if you want rank.avg to consider the numbers, in an ascending order. Going forward, here is an objective of using the rank.avg function. To assign a rank to calories in food. Ok, we are all set to type the rank.avg function formula. First, type equal to symbol, type ran and select rank.avg For value, click this cell Type comma For data, select this range Press enter Cancel autofill, as it does not apply in this case there you go. Rank.avg has assigned a rank to the calories in this food. Before we copy the formula down these cells, we have to make the address of this range absolute. This is because we do not want the address to change, as we copy the formula. Click this cell. Click before letter C. Press F4. OK, the address is now absolute. Press Enter. Copy the formula down these cells, and deselect. OK, rank.avg has assigned the ranks to the calories in these food. Alright, let's look at these ranks. Recall that for a duplicate value set, rank.avg assigns the same rank, which is the average of sequential ranks. The sequential ranks of these duplicate values are, 2 and 3. The average of these numbers is 2.5. Note that rank.avg has assigned a rank of 4, and not 3, to this calorie value. This is because, 3 is the sequential rank of this duplicate value. As the last part of this tutorial, let's assign ranks to the calories, in the ascending order. For this, we need to assign a value of 1, to the as ascending argument. Recall that the default value for as ascending is 0. Click this cell. Click here, type comma, and type 1. Press enter. Copy the formula down these cells. There you go. Rank.avg has assigned ranks in the ascending order. 
Quick review. Rank.avg assigns a rank to specified value by comparing it to other values in specified dataset. Rank.avg assigns same rank, which is average of sequential ranks of duplicate values to each set of duplicate values, if any, in dataset. Rank.avg can assign a rank to a value by considering values in dataset in an ascending or a descending order. The default is descending order. That's it folks. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to this channel.